If you take out Saddam, Saddam's regime, I guarantee you that it will have enormous positive reverberations on the region. And I think that people sitting right next door in Iran, young people, uh, and many others will say, the time of such regimes, of such just bots, is gone. There is a new age. Something new is happening. And that Iraq is speculation on your part, or you have uh, some evidence to that effect? Uh, you know, I was, uh, I was asked the same question in, uh, in 1986. I had uh, uh, written uh, a book in which I had said uh, that the way to deal with uh, terrorist uh, regimes, well, with terror, was to deal with the terrorist regimes. And the way to deal with the terrorist regimes, among other things, was to uh, apply military force against them. To the way we them. did in uh, Afghanistan. The way, for example, I, I want to answer your question. Well, I guess Mr. I'm running out of time, so I quickly was trying to get there. We've done, I think, what you proposed in Afghanistan, yet I haven't seen that sort of neighborhood effect. Well, I think, I think there's been an, an enormous effect. Uh, the effect was, we were told that there would be uh, a contrary effect. First of all, people said that there would be tens of thousands of people streaming into Afghanistan, zealots who would be outraged by America's action, and this would produce a counter reaction in the Arab world. But I think what you're happened, not saying that when you take an action like we did in Afghanistan, we're going to see all the other countries just fall. No, what we saw happen. is something else. First of all, we saw everybody streaming out of Afghanistan. The second thing we saw is all the Arab countries and many Muslim countries trying to side with America, trying to make to be okay with America. The application of power is the most important thing in winning the war on terrorism. If I had to say, what are the three principles of winning the war on terror? It's like, what are the three principles of real estate, the three L's, location, location, location? The three principles of winning the war on terror are the three W's, winning, winning, and winning. The more victories you amass, the easier the next victory becomes. The first victory in Afghanistan makes the second victory in Iraq that much easier. The second victory in Iraq will make the third victory that much easier too, but it may change the nature of achieving that victory. May. It may be possible to have implosions taking place. I don't guarantee it, Mr. Turney, but I think it makes it more likely 